Might I be of assistance? Might you be of assistance? I don't know. Might you be? We're following this guy, and he's taking us to the capital. Welcome back, everyone, by the way. This is part four of Dragon's Dogma 2. And, uh, yeah, he's leading us to the capital. I wonder if we'll run into anything crazy along the way. We've already had a few fights. Oh, I guess this is the capital. Is this it? If so, that was a really short here walk. A I shall fit them open the gate. That was a really short walk. Ellipsian says, it is actually possible to trade items using the pawn system if you need anything, I gotcha. Well, uh, thank you for the offer. If I get stuck at any point in the game, I'll, I'll, I'll consider that. Obviously, I don't want to cheat and just turbo through, but uh, we'll see what happens. Dark Gaming says, I may have to dip out. I'm fully exploring the first map of the dungeons. I don't want to be spoiled. Oh, it's all good, man. I get the feeling a lot of people will be like that today. Keep in mind, I'm playing this all day today. This is now the beginning of my second session, so I'll get I'll have like five, six hours of gameplay up today, but then I've got to go back and focus on the other two RPGs I've been playing to finish them this week. I'll be returning to this one right after that, so a lot of people will get way ahead of me and then be able to come join the streams after the fact. Rush fan, good evening. Good to have you here. He says, looking forward to seeing the game. And I received a $2 tip from Mr. Game Master. He says, I just beat Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. 60 hours doing a lot of main story. I rushed it because I want to play Rise of the Ronin. But I also bought Peach and Dogma 2. But I wait, wait, may wait for Dogma 2 to have better FPS. Is it choppy? It's not choppy. It's 30 frames. And the thing is, most people aren't used to 30 frames anymore. We've had, you know, how many years of being used to conditioning of 60 frames. So when you play the game, you're like, oh, it's choppy. It's, it's not. It's just, it's half frame rate of what you usually get in any other game, right? So, okay. Thank you for the tip. Who's that you've brought with you, Watchhead, sir? An arisen, by all appearances. Is there a way to make the subtitles bigger? I didn't see that option. I'm gonna check, but I didn't see it. An arisen? Another pretender, you mean? Oh. I see the Sovereign's ascension has done little to stop such charlatans from plying their trade. Uh, Dark Gaming says he made his pawn Lazel, and he found someone's Shadowheart pawn, which is a healer. It's a perfect combination. <laughs> Fox Mulder saying, I'm having fun with Rise of the Ronin. I like it because I love samurai games. Again, I was on the fence about which one to play, and you guys convinced me to play Dragon's Dogma 2 right now. But uh, I hope I hope Rise of the Ronin is good. It's a possibility I may play it. I may still play it. It is uncertain. <clears throat> this one commands the loyalty of the pawns. What? Impossible. <laughs> you know as well as I do that there can be but one Arisen, and he's up in the power. Oh, so let me get this straight. Now what they're saying is, you're the true Arisen? And the, the person who's the ruler here is claiming to be Arisen. You're going to find out they're the liar. I'm well aware of how preposterous the idea is, thank you. However, as I do not believe it my place to rule on such a matter, <laughs> I would make my report to the capital. If the claim is false, we will be rewarded handsomely for our trouble. If the claim is true... What the fuck? They fuse together. Ew. Yo, the two guys are standing on each other. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit. That's a problem. That looks pretty disturbing. All's been arranged. Come. Let us pass. That is a botched Super Saiyan fusion right there, man. Yikes. Yes, I'm playing this on the Xbox Series X. That is correct. So, okay. Can we f do anything about the subtitle size? Because, man, those are t absolutely tiny. Um, I can read them, but I know some of you might be having problems with it. Especially if you're watching at a lower resolution. Uh, language, subtitles on, subtitle. Nah, see? All of the subtitles on. And subtitle background capacity, dark. Yeah, I, I definitely want the dark. Wow, that is not a lot of options at all. That is pretty bad, honestly. I really wish that they had more options than that. That's pretty, pretty sad, actually. Well, I guess we gotta stare at these tiny subtitles the whole game. Sheesh. Happy Friday, uh, Sai. I'm glad to hear that you and your wife are enjoying the streams. Well, obviously we're not going to run into any enemies if we're past this defensive gate. Right? Go for a job. Come on. I'll race ya. Come on, a little, little friendly competition. Uh-oh. Oh, great. Well, we'll probably have to fight some monsters then. What's funny is we already fought the optional giant ogre, which or, or giant cyclops, which I'll probably you weren't supposed to fight this early, but we got it done. But now I'm wondering, uh, anything in here? Now I'm wondering if we're about to fight like another big monster. Like the idea is that the monster took out the ox cart or something. A treasure chest. 
Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? No, I will make the decisions and you will keep your mouth shut. But <laughs> may we see if we can keep your lips from flapping? <laughs> no, I actually like that they talk like this. It makes it feel, even though they're pawns and you know they're not real, it makes them feel like real companions to your party because they're acting as such, you know? A decent spot for a campsite. Oh, we can do a new campsite. Oh, wait a minute, that wasn't no campsite. Look what it is. Holy moly. It's a new stone, a new rift stone. Well, I don't want to change out my pawns right now, but that's pretty cool. This is basically like a makeshift town then. You got a rift stone, you got a campsite. Here's a new camping pack. Now we already have a modest camping kit because we found it on a side mission. So this would have been we're in the story if we hadn't gotten the camping kit yet, that we would have gotten it, but we already have it. Cool. Do a quick restore. Oh, I agree. Frank says, I'm really liking the stream, even though this is another RPG and you've been playing a million of these, it's a little different with the commentary and the, the funny stuff that's been happening. Oh yeah, earlier, we, in the first, this guy won't shut up. In the first scene out of the tutorial, we threw a guy off a cliff and he was a story character and he's just gone. He never came back. I don't even know what was supposed to happen. We just tossed him right off the cliff and the game continued. So I guess it wasn't that bad. <laughs> it was pretty impressive. There's been some funny stuff happening. I fell off a cliff into water. And then one of my pawns fell off a cliff by accident and died. So I had to summon another one. It was pretty interesting. <laughs> uh, Sarah, what I would say is only only uh, give like advice if it looks like I'm stuck on something. Right now, I am enjoying just kind of messing with the world myself. Or, for example, if there's a case here where the game essentially is like not being clear about something that would be really helpful. Like earlier, it didn't explain crafting. It didn't explain really the camping system properly. It didn't really explain that much. I think the game, they're going for Dark Souls-like, where I you kind of figure stuff out for yourself. But, you know, I am day. trying to make progress and play the oh, game and enjoy it. Much to be getting on with. Now, do you think I could cross this day. river? Uh... You can grab some fish. So I want you guys to wait here. Okay, over here. Wait here. I told them to wait. I'm gonna see if I can cross this river. Oh, that's a no. Unless I run, maybe I can run through the blight. We can try it, I want that chest. I'm gonna try it, ready? Or can you go around, do you think? Oh, that was bad choice. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna try to, to jump through it and see what happens, you ready? Go, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'm making it, I'm making it, I'm making it, I'm making it. I did it. Sweet. Whoa, wake stone and a wake stone shard. Three shards combined, I have formed a wake stone. That's my first one. Now, what wake stones do, I don't have a clue. <laughs> but it said in my inventory that I needed three. So I got it. So how does this work? A stone ensorcelled with miraculous magic formed with a wake stone shard that holds the power to restore the dead to life. It's a revival item. It's a revival item. Now, how do you use it? I guess you're just supposed to know. Rakestones auto... Do they auto-revive you when you die? It's an auto-revive? If so, that's amazing. I'm very happy. This is how you're supposed to do it, by the way. You're supposed to climb that rock, obviously. But I'm too stupid to know that. Okay, here we go. All right, cool. We got our first wake stone. In fact, why don't I save? Since that was something new, let's save. There we go. Cool, I'm glad I, uh, I tried that. It seems like this game just gives you the freedom to kind of mess around and do whatever you want. And some stuff works and some stuff doesn't. But when it works, it's kind of neat, right? I like the freedom that the game gives you to mess around. Wait, I'll collect that. where am I going? You I just realized I don't know where I'm going. Where did our guide go? Travel together for a day and a night. Scarlet's Pawn Quest. Cool. Here we are. We're going here. I was like, where did the guy go? Here he is. I am attentive and loyal and prefer to Beautiful be Joe. Oh, uh, you look nothing like Beautiful Joe. For the record. Uh, nah. We'll pass. We'll pass. 
Yeah, dark gaming. That happened. Oh, oh, that happened to me before, where the pawn fell off the cliff. That can't be good. What the hell is caused? Oh my God! Why is there an earthquake? Wow, what is going on? Is everyone all right? Look out for the deer, you stupid idiot! You're about to get trampled. <laughs> See, funny stuff like that just happens in the game. Dude, he's about to get clobbered. More marks of the dragon's fury. Its rampage must have weakened the earth here. <laughs> That's funny. It would have been hilarious if they knocked him over. That would have been even more funny, but I guess they narrowly missed. Can we go up there? Oh, 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 I hear goblin. I hear a gobby. Hello, gobby. It's a bad thing to rest of We must not let down our body. Let my magic infuse the weapon with the fury of the elements. Where'd he go? Hey, fucking camera. Why'd he do that? The camera went completely out of the way. I couldn't see what was going on. Got the gobbies. Killed the gobbies. They're all dead. I have nothing to share at present. What the fuck? I want to talk to you. Never mind. <laughs> There's more gobbies. Heal back that bitch. Whoa! Someone used a crazy lightning spell. Holy shit. Alrighty then. So I think... I wonder if we could have climbed. Because I saw like a tree that was heading up that looked like you could climb it. Like a bridge. But now I lost it. I don't know where the hell it was. Alright, I guess we just keep following the guy. I don't see it now. I thought I saw like a tree that was up, going up like a, a bridge, but okay. It was excellent. Yeah! I Shield bash that bitch! I oh shit, that guy plunged. Oh, they're all dead. We're killing them so fast. We're seriously killing them so dang fast. We don't really have a chance to do anything. One thing that's a little annoying, you loot with B, but B also makes you run. So you're trying to loot and you end up running over the body and not looting it. Very frustrating. And they should have made it two different buttons in my opinion. I dare say the park shan't be traversing. I can do that too, look, we both have the same ability. You just stood there like an idiot. Did I get it? See, did I get the loot? No, I didn't get it. The, bu the loot button is the same as the talk well button. Master. Oh, we did a little pose. You saw that? The victory pose. Yeah, the loot button is the same as the talk button. Is Oh, shit. It's the same as, as the too many other buttons. There's triple uh, chests here, I think. No one can defend themselves with a gun. Can't see. What the fuck's going on? Did I kill him? There's a guy up here. Hold on. I can't. I'm trying to get up there. Get them all? I guess that was it. Yeah, I thought he'd be like hiding something back here, but no. It's just uh. I've just recalled. I found a treasure chest near here. Yeah, this loops back to where we were, the and they're getting the treasure chest for me. To its location. That's pretty cool that they'll loot the chests for you, so that way you don't have to do it. Oh, these are explosive barrels, man. We would have been able to like throw those down if we had known if we had come from the other direction. Eleven 1 hundred gold is a pretty good uh, haul. That's a good thing. And here's an item. What is this? Rare item. It's a sy syrup wart leaf. What the fuck is a syrup wart leaf? I don't know, but we'll probably craft with it. Yeah, you know, can I loot? No, see, these guys already got looted. Sometimes they auto loot. Sometimes they don't. It's a little confusing. You could change the run button. I might want to. I don't like B being everything. I don't want B to be every action in the game. That's going to frustrate me later on, I think. Oh, shit. What's that? Harpies? Yep. Gathering of beasts. Hello. What the? I tried to do an attack. And I got knocked off of the damn wood. I don't want to climb this wood. Executed. I can't even tell what's going on. They, they bring the lightning bolts down on that one. I'm asleep. Some asshole put me to sleep. Look. 
Can't even move. Uppercut. Nice. My new uppercut move. Well, not really an uppercut. It's, a, it's supposed to be an aerial attack for the, the winged enemies, and it worked. That worked well. Chopped it up. Jagged bones. We could obtain some rare materials here, if it pleases you, Master. Really? Where do you well see? Spotted. Where do you see rare materials? Here? Oh no, that's just a dead enemy. Oh, I got a golden trove beetle. Oh, cool. That means more carry capacity for me. I don't know where that was. Was it on the enemy? Maybe it was on the enemy. This is on Xbox. I'm playing it on Xbox, Demolition Daddy. Yes. Can I climb up here? Oh, no. Get up there. Okay, you go here. Okay, look, there's a chest right here and a bunch of goblins. Gobbies! Kill those gobbies! Shit, I... Why did you do that, idiot? The guy's right in front of you. Oh! Why would you cast lightning on me? The enemy's here. I just killed the enemy. Here we go. Ready? Oh, what the... Wow, they clubbed the shit out of me. I couldn't see him through the fire here. I can't see anything. <laughs> What's going on? I guess I'm clobbering. I guess the fire knocked him down and I clobbered him. Oh, he's already dead. Level 9. Sheesh, we just steamroll everything at this point. The only thing that's really giving us a challenge was the ogre, right? Oh, there's another one. Oh, you fuckface. You, oh my god, you have to be me off the cliff. You dickhead. What a complete dick. Now Elric's level 9. I can't get up here. I'm so, <laughs> I'm sliding up and down. Oh my god. I'm sliding all over the place. Okay. Here we go. Another, one of those spells. One time use only spells. Climb over here. Oh, look, there's a chest over here. I didn't even see. It's a fancy chest. Yon chest lies just beyond our ring reach. of indifference. I, approach it. I should see what that ring is, huh? Let's see. I already have two rings. Let's see if Elric wants it. Oh, do I have to give it to him? That's kind of silly, but I guess I have to actually hand it to him. Reduces damage taken from strike attacks. Yeah, let's give that to Elric. How do I do that? Give to Elric. Have Elric uh, equip it. Cool. So I have more defense against striking. Excellent. Okay. Can't climb here? Oh, come on. No. I wonder if later you get better climbing ability. Because your climbing ability is very limited right now. Fuck this thing. It's out of my fucking way. There's another chest. Sweet. Oh, well spotted. A soft neck Indeed. wrap. Good on you for being so observant. Let's give that to uh, Elric as well, right? Uh, would that be under? Here we go. Yeah, let's give this to Elric. Equip. Cool. Now Elric has a nice scarf to wear. But, okay, I have to admit, I was missing... I mean, not to say that this wasn't happening with, with Baldur's Gate 3, but I was missing RPGs where when you put items on your character, you see them immediately, and it's reflected in the world. I like that. So I like that everyone's appearance is changing as we find new equipment for them. Pizza Box Gaming, thank you so much for a $20 super chat. He said, what's up, Phil and Chai? I was away on a business trip this week. I'm back in the hotel now, and I can chill with you guys. I'm sad I missed your uh, dog when debut, but I'm here now. How are you liking it? I am liking it, and it's uh, it's growing on me and getting better the further in we get. I am enjoying it. As of now, the frame rate hasn't really been an issue, which is the major complaint everyone has that the frame rate's too low. But I'm enjoying the game, you know, pretty pretty much uh, like any other RPG. I like the action. It's action-based. Can't you instantly kill the goblins after you stagger them at low health? I think you hit Y. It's a mechanic that took a while. Yeah, you if they're on the ground, you go like this and stab them, or you do the jumping stab, and it basically kind of insta-kills them if they're just kind of standing around wobbly. So, yes, you can do that. What's weird is it's showing a treasure chest because there's one way up there. You see that? Now, how would I get there? Can I climb? Because, again, my climbing ability is very limited. See? 
I can't really... I, I can't get up there to get this chest. See, I slide. My, I suck. How would I get up there to get that chest up there? You see it? It's, a, it's probably like a rare chest. No, I can't. Look. He just grabs and doesn't... I guess I can't do it. Right? I don't know. I'd wager our merry band can mm. handle whatever comes. We ought to Any idea, guys? How I could get up there right now? Or maybe I just Quite can't. Even. Maybe I have to be more agile or something. But I, it looks like I can't climb the wall to get the rare chest. Hmm. I don't see a way to do it. Cyber TV says the game is different than other RPGs. Definitely closer to Dark Souls. It's definitely closer to Dark Souls. The combat's different, but the whole idea of open world exploring and everything, it's very Dark Souls-esque. Wait, can I maybe do it from a higher ledge like this? Oh, fuck. See, I fell again. I can't... No, that's it. That's where I have to go, and I can't do it. Magic user could fly up there. Do you think so? I don't think... Is there a flight ability? I don't know, because I'm not a magic user. Basically, the gra the grabbing and cl climbing is very limited. And it sucks. I have to leave behind that chest now. I killed all the goblins, but I don't get all the rewards because I don't know how to get up there. Mage classes can levitate, which lets them go up walls, or warrior classes can launch you up the wall. Oh, well, I don't have a warrior yet. We're, we're too early in the game for that, right? Here's another chest. We're way too early in the game for warrior. We're just level 3 fighter right now. For those who don't know, Warrior is the higher class of Warrior. Once you max Warrior, you can elevate to the, to the next. Oh, is that a camp? It is a camp. We should probably do that. While we're out here. Where are you guys taking us? Past that camp or a different way? Nah, see, he wants to go to the right, I think. Let's see where he wants to go. Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? What are you doing? Don't get stuck. Uh, oh no, he's taking us past the camp. Okay, that's where we're going. You cannot climb You're like Zelda. The game actually forces you to navigate and figure it out. Master. Magic users love it. All right, well. Where I find a good use. Might as well just keep making camps. Every time we see it, it's free. There's no reason to not make a camp and get a free deal. And it's also a save point when you do it. It actually saves your game, so it's it's totally worth it to do it. Okay. Uh, let's see here. So thank you so much, Pizza Box, for that very generous super chat. I got a dollar tip from Game Master. I'm one hour in the run, and it's a nice break from RPGs. It's way better than uh, Wan Long. You mean Wulong from last year? It's a mix of Ghost of Tsushima and Neo, and all the people saying the graphics are bad or wrong, it looks good. That's what they said. They said it was like Ghost of Tsushima and Neo, but no, actually what they said, it was Assassin's Creed and Neo, and if you remember, the number one game that everyone said Ghost of Tsushima played like was Assassin's Creed. That totally makes sense. I may eventually check it out. It's just that more people said they wanted me to play this, and quite frankly, I was more interested in this to begin with. So, it's all good. We should, after we finish these two lingering RPGs, we should have time to play many other things. Greenware-ish. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Long comes trudging along. You get the other classes, you have to collect weapons for it first. If you get something that is not the initial class, don't throw it away. Okay. Gotcha. So far, the only thing I really got rid of was the wizard helmet. I couldn't wear it, and I'm not. I'm never going to be a wizard in this playthrough. I do find jumping and climbing and stabbing big enemies into weak points more fun in this. In Dragon's Dogma 1, I loved doing that. Because that's why I wanted to go for another melee class. Oh, we're not trapped anymore. Is another Cyclops? Indeed it is. We already fought an optional one. Now it's time to fight the one for the story. This one has reduced health. Okay. I, a Cyclops. To think we'd encounter one here. Oh, he threw his club. Oh shit. Cyclops. Be on your guard. Thanks for giving me a hang on spot, bro. And now I know how to restore my stamina. Grabbing larger foes. Oh yes. Strike I'm aware. Fast and true, and our quarry shall fall. Time for big damage, motherfucker. Stab in the back of the head. Look at this. Right in the back of the the, the deep of the skull there. That's gotta be a big painful spot, man. Alright, can I use a fine? Yes, I got my stamina back. Oh, I used it, but he threw me off. Shit. 
I used an item to restore my stamina and he threw me off anyway. Then he hammered my ass. Grab the ass. Grab the stinky ass of the Cyclops. <laughs> so what you have to do is keep aiming for the head, and if he moves you after you have to change the direction you're pressing on the thumbstick, it can be quite tricky. Sticky. Okay, I restored some stamina. Oh god, he's trying to shake me off. Oh, I fell off. God damn it. And then he does the ball bounce, but he missed. He stunned me, but he didn't actually do damage. So that's good. Look, he's pissed. He's swinging all over the place. That did good damage. Alright, go for it again. Epic music. Oh, bitey faces down. I, I know, I know. You already explained this mechanic to me. Thanks, game. Right in the face, come on. No, I'm getting him in the shoulder instead of the face. That sucks. Well, I fucked his eye up. Yeah, I did. I fucked his eye up right there. Look, he's stunned, but I can't do anything about it because I have no stamina. Ooh. I stabbed him right in the face. Nice. It would seem I misjudged you. I had taken you for another force arisen. Goodness knows we see a lot of them. What is that noise? The fuck is that noise going on? Yet the valley you showed in coming to our aid has dispelled such thoughts. Here, take this as a mark of my. Could you stop that annoying alarm? Give it to one of the <laughs> Someone's car alarm is going off. To the capital. Someone's it's stealing a fucking Hyundai behind you. Captain Brandt. You're free to make your own way to the capital now. I see no need to keep you under constant watch, and I'm sure you'll breathe a little easier as well. Right? Of course, if you'd rather continue to accompany us, you are still welcome to join us on your Some side. assholes combing the beach it's behind him for fucking coins and shit in the sand. What is that noise, man? I know that bitey face is down. Is that what the noise is? Seriously? Wow, that is an obnoxious noise. Now, where the... Wait a minute. Where's the body? Oh, here it is. I was like, where's the body? I want to loot it, obviously. Rugged bone. Rugged bone. Rugged bone. That's what we sold. We sold the rugged bones earlier. Ugh. Graphics are... Look at that. That's just cool, man. It looks great. So much better than the first game. It looks super realistic. So he said we're free to go as much, uh, wherever we want. We don't have to follow him to the capital. But... <clears throat> Maybe we want to follow him to the capital? Is this the capital? No, that's the excavation site. Like, I actually don't know how to get to the capital myself, so... I think maybe I should follow him, right? Or maybe, is there a new quest? Make your way to the capital. Travel to the capital to affirm your identity. They're exactly the same quest! I'll, I'll still travel with him if he'll have me. Will you have me? Yeah, I guess we can still travel together. What does Cat's Pawn look like? I don't know. I haven't seen it. I haven't, I haven't watched her play because I'm avoiding spoilers. What the hell is this? It looks like, like a rare mineral, but it's just a rock. I thought it was like obsidian or something. A stupid rock. Ah, here's the cart now. Do you intend to join us? Accompany them to the capital or make your own way. Should we make our own way? What do you guys think? <clears throat> I'm says I walk to the capital. It's not too bad. You'll get some good loot. All right, let's let's uh, go our own way then. Very well, but for your own sake, I recommend you make your way to the capital sooner rather than later. Let's do some optional fighting and stuff, right? And find some enemies. That'd be neat. I see a ladder yonder, but we can't reach it from here. We'll have to go get our own way. Drop it down. <clears throat> Would you guys like stop saying 30 frames per second in the chat? Like we understand it's 30 frames per second. We're not blind. Uh you can stop complaining now. Like we get it. It's 30 frames. It's not the end of the world. The game is still fun. <laughs> you know, like uh, all right, I get it. Every single person has to say 30 frames at least 7 or 8 times, right? Like you can't stand it. 
<clears throat> Good lord. By the way, it's a new stone. I think we'll keep our party for now. Another one of these stones. But we no no campsite here. Now, they had said there was a ladder, but we can't reach it. Yeah, look. Do you think our archer could hit that? I can proceed no further. No. The archer can't... I thought maybe the archer could shoot it or whatever, but... <clears throat> yeah, I guess not. It sucks. It looks like you should be able to get up there, but I don't know how. Maybe it's from a different direction or something. Hmm. What the hell? Look at his body. Yo, look at the, sorry, the Cyclops' body. He's trying to sit up. He's trying to get up like a zombie. He's, he's just faking. He's actually not dead. Look. Oh, yeah. What if I get closer again? Oh, yeah. Oh, nope, nope. Now we went back down. Now what if I start to walk away? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Wow. Wow. All right, Derek, see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Is he snowed in Toronto? They had tons of snow today. Go our way here. Yeah, there's no way out there for us to get to that ladder. Maybe eventually we'll get this levitation spell I'm being told about. Obviously, they want us to follow the road, but I just want to check little side areas. Now, guys, please don't fall. Please don't fall. I don't have to start, start resummoning pawns already. <clears throat> Got some enemies up there. And I, I can't reach them because they're high up. We need our archer and a magician to take them down. That's definitely like an ambush route. Let's try this way. Maybe we could cycle behind them and kill them from behind. No. No. That's just... It's a straight-up ambush. It doesn't look like there's a way for us to... To get them. Oh, thank you for getting the pity ward. You see, maybe we can craft anything new. Barspid Ruberant. Whoa, this is a... Detoxifying decoction. Counteracts poison and venom. Fire quelling. This is interesting. Okay. That's it. That's all we got. But we got a, a, a cure for poison now. So that's good. <clears throat> Very nice. Yeah, let's do that. Let's save as well. And uh, I received a $6 tip. Better call Darth Maul is enjoying the game so far. I mean, it's pretty apparent I am, right? I really like the big fights. I can't wait to fight more of the big enemies because they're really awesome, fun fights. Especially when you get to the more unique. I remember some of them spit gi giant uh, you know, magic spells and shit at you. And uh, it's, it's interesting and neat. So hopefully we get to some of that. I don't know if we'll get to it tonight, but we'll find out. See, if we could go up this way, we could we could get to those goblins. I don't think they're going to let us. Are you trying to hide in the, in the guard here? He was. Nope. Fuck out of here. I want to loot. Can't. I Done. No lessons. Oh, oh shit, that was cool. Shield bash that shit. Build him with the shield bash. Can't see. Camera's fucked up. The camera can be a problem when there's a lot of action going on. It doesn't lock on to anything. Where'd you come from? But he was dead. Fall back, and I will heal you with my magic. Oh, good. Yes, heal, please. No, some money. More enemies. Yeah, these are the ones that are gonna be up there. See, 
The quest. Whoa, Elric got all the way up there. How do you do that? See, Elric must be able to do it. I can't get up there. The paths to victory are myriad indeed. That strategy never would have occurred to me. It is not what I expected. More up here? Yeah, I hear him. Oh, there's all kinds of loot up here. Look at all this. Look. Harpy pinions. Gold. And a chest. Ah, take that. A savagery extract. Meanwhile, they're still down there fighting the goblins while I loot everything. I wanted to destroy that. There we go. Figured you could. Look at this guy. Hold on. Come over here. Shield bash. Oh. One more. Boom. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Squishy. <laughs> Squishy goblin. That's what I'm talking about. Very nice. That's the effective use of the shield bash right there. Grand petal. All right. Well. We're good now. Now we gotta go back down. I got the items up here. Gotta find the effective way I'll down without dying. You needn't trouble yourself. Shit. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Just slide. Okay, good. That worked. The meat. Okay. Go back down. Nobody fall. What are you guys doing on the Oh no, Scarlet! Scarlet face planted. There's still an enemy. Oh, how the hell how is he how did I not see him? I have no ranged attacks. I can't hit him. It's up to them to take him out. I can't get that guy. Ugh, why are you got Forget it. I'm not killing that one. I'm leaving that guy. We're leaving the one stupid... Uh... Goblin. In there. Good evening, Dentronics. Alright, Fox. I'll see you on Sunday. More gold. I don't even know how the MP works in this game because I'm not a magic class, so I don't know if it's limited MP, if it regenerates by itself. It must because I, I don't have any MP regenerative items, so I guess it just auto-regenerates and you can keep casting spells. Am I going to buy, buy a PS5 Pro? I don't think anything that I, buy, that I play would benefit from a PS5 Pro because I'm only playing a 1080p. I really don't see it being a big deal. If there's a huge deal in in performance, maybe I would. But I don't see the point in getting it. Number one, you know when PS5 Pro comes out, there's going to be exactly the same situation as we had with fucking PS5. Where everyone's going to want it. It's going to take months to get it. You got to pre-order it. You got to try to sneak your way into a secret code to get it somewhere. You got to get scalpers online selling it for triple price. Is it really worth it? Am I really going to get anything out of it? Probably not, right? <clears throat> Do we have a traveling vendor? We do. Hello. I've got wares of every ilk. What he's got? Anything that I want? Uh, Spago Nudo says, yes, it auto-regenerates like in the first game. Okay. Am I skipping the South Park game? Of course I am. It's trash. It looks atrociously bad. Uh. What's up, JD? He says, I'm a little tired of RPGs. I love Like a Dragon. I don't know if I love this. Yeah, I, I'm liking it. It's very similar to the original game, and I'm enjoying it. But I hear you with the amount of RPGs we've been playing... You can get tired out. We have uh, a Traveler's Gators. Slightly more defense, a lot more like knockdown resistance, but less magic defense. So, nah. The Miner's Hosen actually is better overall than everything I'm wearing right now. The Miner's Hosen. I could afford two, so I could get one for me, and I could probably get one for Elric, too, if I buy them. Miner's Hosen. That would be all my money, though, but then I could sell them. You know what? I think I'll buy them. And then I can sell the other stuff. Yeah, sell the, the napped leather boots. Suits to the captain. That's for the quest, right? And same thing here. Leg armor. Napped leather boots. There you go. Okay, so I'm not totally broke. 
they give you a decent amount of uh, money back when you when you sell stuff to these vendors. It's not like you know pennies on the dollar. That's not Our bad a bad value. Much depleted after that indulgence. We have a journey to prepare for after all. We can't afford to cut corners. Correct. Got better boots now. Yeah, they don't look stupid. Those last boots would look dumb. These look better. Look. These demos look more realistic. The other ones were like big floppy boots. Alright, let's continue. Uh-oh. More, uh... Got more gobbies. Onward at the gobbies. Rust in the eyeball. Did you see that? I tried to parry, but I wasn't facing it right here, actually. That it? There's only three of them. Well, a waterfall. Don't, what are you doing? Don't stand there. You fall off this bridge, you're dead. Crazy. Dare I say it? We trounced our foe well and true. We mustn't allow ourselves to be Trounced that foe well and true. Take each trial as it comes. Indeed. Loading or saving here. Anything over here? Yep, more gobbies. Mm, double stabby. I tried to block, but I was too late. Burn the man. Burn their asses. A lot of gobbies is the early enemies. Yeah, if I remember correctly, fucking... Oh, take a wild guess, guys. I wonder if you guys will figure this out. Take a wild guess what was the most annoying enemy, I think, in Dragon's Dogma 1. Let's see if you guys can remember. find some rare materials here. Well spotted. Shall we see what we can find? Anyone remember? Anyone ever watched the original playthrough? I mean, it's over a decade old. I wouldn't blame you if you didn't. Harpies. Well, harpies are annoying until you have ranged people. Then they're not that annoying at all. Nope, not harpies. Nope, not wolves. Okay, the chimera, that's a good guess. Because the chimera are some of the hardest enemies in Dragon's Dogma 1. Nope, for me it was the fucking skeletons. Because you can't see them. You walk into an area... And all of a sudden, a ton of skeletons would raise off the ground and fuck you up. You're like, oh, I had no idea there was this many fucking skeletons here. <laughs> and you just get rocked. So I don't understand this whole rare materials. Look, do you see any rare materials here? I certainly don't. Look, there's nothing here. Is this considered a rare material, I guess? A syrup wort leaf? I don't know. Yeah, it was the fucking skeleton. Exactly, the meme that I hate skeletons. That was part of it. It was that, that and when I played... Uh, Dragon Age Origins. Those are the two games where skeletons fucked me up constantly and I was pissy, pissy with skeletons. But yeah, in this game, the, well, at least in the original, you couldn't even see them and they just rise off the ground and start fucking you up out of nowhere. Like, I didn't even know there was any enemies in this area. That sucks. Oh, shitty ass. Don't fall. I was like, that sucks. So we'll have to see how bad the skeletons are in this one. Grab those grapes. Those delicious, fresh grapes. Do not fall, please. Come on, man. <laughs> Do you see the problem with the, the gathering button being exactly the same as the dash button? You end up fucking dashing off the cliff. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, you fucking bitch. I can't see. Oh, she's got me. Oh, a fucking heartbeat at me. All right, I got out. Holy shit, they're singing. La, la, la. Fuck you. I can't... There we go. Execute. There's a lot of them. They're in both directions, too. Get off my teammate, fucker. Mighty face is asleep. Oh, come on! Oh, I missed! I couldn't free them. Damn. Aerial attack worked perfectly. I'm so glad I got it. Now execute that thing. Yeah! Seems like fire is really effective in the early game, right? Because, oh shit! Oh no, that's not good! Oh, I got a hot ass! I got a hot ass! My ass is hot! Okay. There we go. <laughs> Ooh, vocation rank up. Very nice. Level 4 now. But, uh, no, what I was gonna say was, the fire seems to do some good damage over time against these early enemies. So wait, can I go up here? Is this a dead end? No, I can go up here. There's different ways to go, it looks like, right?
Are these crafting materials or? Yeah, look, blueberry. There's more crafting materials up here. I don't know if there's anything good up here. It looks like that's about it, right? This is nothing. Yeah, there's nothing up here. It's a higher level. It doesn't lead to anything. It's just a, it's a trick. <laughs> nothing there. Go back. Whew. Okay. Okay, I guess we keep climbing up here. Me thinks we could move this boulder if we work together. Oh really? Shall this boulder here? Rolling? Let's try it. Oh shit! Work together. We didn't really need to work together. The thing just went flying. I don't know what the significance of that was. It didn't really do anything for us, right? Oh, we found a camp! Oh sweet! Oh no, it's not a camp, it's one of these. It's a far stone. Okay. Well that's cool. Cause I again remember if, if one of our uh if one of our guys had died, we would have been able to summon a new one. Wait a minute. Where's Elric? Where the fuck is Elric? He's in the party still. Where is he? He's over there? How do you even get over there? I don't know. There's a chest across the way. Did you see it? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, you, 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 you. The fucking up, fucking up, fucking up. Get the fuck up Have there, dude. That is not good. Whoa, no, I don't want to do this. I picked up bitey face. How did I put her down? Uh, I don't shortcut throw release. I'm sorry. I really didn't mean to do that. That was a mistake. Now, I saw a chest. Oh, it's across the way. See that? Okay, if we go if we go the other way, we may be able to get that chest. We got another far stone unlocked. I think people were saying you can fast travel to the far stones, but you need to get the item to do it. Here we go. Beast skin. Two withered branches. Now I'm heavy. I'm going to have to do something about that. And yeah, what's in the chest? A weak stone shard. All right, cool. Good, fine. I'm going to have to transfer some items over. I don't want to be heavy. Uh. Hmm. Do these weigh a lot? 0.2 kilograms? Not that much. I wish you could sort by weight. You cannot sort by weight, so you don't actually don't know what weighs you down, right? Shit. It might just be I have so much, right? I assume I need the healing items in my inventory, right? But probably not the other stuff. Where's Elric? Where'd you go? Elric keeps, like, running away. He's on the other side. Look where he is. What the shit? He's way the hell over there. What's he doing that for? He likes to explore by himself, I guess. I guess he's supposed to be, like, a, a rogue or ranger. He's, he's, like, scouting. I guess so. Trying to get my overall weight down here. Ability extract. Not really doing that much. Well, for now I'm all right, I guess. I work is just going crazy over there. There are 240 seeker coins hidden in the world. Did I find a seeker coin? Oh, uh, better call Dark Malt of the Dollar. What's your favorite night movies? What do you mean? What is a night? Oh, you mean like medieval movies? Uh, oh, I don't really have to think hard about that. Because I don't, you know, I, I, I think most of them came out in the 80s and 90s, right? Like, I don't think I've seen a night movie recently. You know, you know one that I saw recently that it started off good and it got really stupid? The Green Knight. Did you ever see that movie? 
I heard that. Oh, it's supposed to be good. It's supposed to be like like it has like Dark Souls esque gothic references and shit. I started watching it. I'm like, okay, it started pretty interesting, and then it just gets so like not that interesting anymore and boring, and the ending makes no fucking sense. And I was like, wow, this movie stinks. And I, I'm actually kind of upset that I watched it. <laughs> like, wow, I, I totally shouldn't have watched it. I didn't like it at all, but the end, the ending, I was like, that was stupid. All right, we got a camp coming up, so that's good. A treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to? Oh, it? a treasure chest. Oh, can we make our way over to the treasure chest? Oh, <laughs> where is it? Is the treasure up here? Oh, 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 oh! It, it. We gotta do a zigzag. You gotta run on the green. Yeah, I see that. The green indicates an area you can actually climb. But now I might be screwed. I don't think I can climb this. No, I can't. This stinks. There's no way to get up here to get the treasure chest. Yeah. Another area where we need a boost or we need a way to climb and we don't have it yet. Did I ever see the fountain doesn't doesn't ring a bell? Uh you ever see the movie Dragonheart and Sean Connery voices the dragon? Uh maybe. It sounds familiar. Yeah, I can't do it. I just can't get up here. It sucks. Treasure chest I can't reach again. Ugh. Frustrating bullshitters. Supposed to be like nimble or something to get up there. Well, I'm not nimble. I'm a big oaf. I'm an oafish fighter. We're supposed to do something with this rock. Here we go. Make a camp. Not gonna eat any food till we need to. <clears throat> La 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 la. We're on a journey, a journey across the kingdom. Is it a kingdom? We don't even know. They re they keep referencing the now ruler, but they didn't say the king, so I don't know if it's actually Come, a king or not. Much to be getting on with. Oh my! Look what's going on over there. Let's. Oh, there's some big enemies. We gotta save these guys. Is it glad they Save him from the wall. Let's do it. Help them. Maybe they'll become our allies. Oh, shit. Oh, you ran away. Get back here. Oh, man. A jumping execution. A brutal jumping execution. Oh, shit. When the, when the lightning comes out, I can't tell what the hell's going on. Good. You guys all right? Appreciate it. Apparently it was a quest. Here, by way of thanks. Domingo, we saved this guy. He gave us 1,200 gold and a scrag of beast and a small fang. The scrag we could probably cook for food, right? Well, we saved them and they were they were grateful. What's this over here? I think I see a chest. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Shall we see if there's ought to be found while we're here? Cyber TV says I'll make an Asterian pawn, and then I'll, you can toss him off of a cliff if you want. As funny as that is, uh, I'll pass. Asterian, let him go on his way. I told you guys, I don't wish misery upon anyone, even those who, who treat me badly in life. I just want everyone to be all right and get and get by and, and safe, and that way everyone will leave each other alone, right? So, no, I don't want to throw Asterian off the cliff. But I do want to loot this other chest I found. We have found a material. Is that another camp? What? Why is there a yet another camp? There was just one over there. There's a crazy amount of camps right here. And then on top of that, there's a building. Unless there's coin in it, I'm not interested. There's some bulls around here. More wolves. I tried to block, I was late. What is that, a zombie? I think it's a zombie. Oh, 
Holy crap, what is going on? Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. Well, I don't know what happened, but I guess uh, this is our shit now. I obviously didn't mean to aggro whatever was in there. He came out and he fought me. Oh well. Napped leather boots. We already had those and they weren't good. Yeah, let me let me hand those over to somebody else. Because I don't want to be encumbered. That's what I got rid of. Yeah. Okay. That's all that was in there. Well, we got some money. We got 1,500 gold, so it was worth coming over here. Another... Wow, we're just finding these everywhere now. Look. Another far stone. These things are absolutely everywhere. I'll gather this. Dark Gaming I says, I stepped into a cave. I saw three health bars appear at the top of my screen, so I turned around and left. <laughs> it is a triple boss fight. That will happen in this game. You'll have to fight like, like, you know, giant groups of, bo of uh, boss level enemies together. Cypress TV says, I'll give Capcom credit. I find that the game fun to watch because the combat's enjoyable. We haven't actually gone to night yet. Usually in the original game at night, enemies would get tougher and the lighting would change completely and some enemy eyes would glow and stuff which is really now neat the vim to tackle the day ahead. oh you're kidding the wolves Come. respawned i didn't know that was gonna happen feeling rested i trust harspid and princess harspid Like a dead end and indeed it is <sighs> all right go back down to the road and follow the road or else we're gonna get lost right <laughs> so i think every time you rest at a camp that's a save point so if you die you can resume from the last time you rested at camp so it always makes sense to rest there if, you, if it's safe you don't want to rest somewhere it's not safe because then you get attacked in your sleep and then you get killed or they, they destroy your camp pack i think you're like to grow overburdened if you keep picking up every little thing. oh my god how am I so overburdened? This is ridiculous. Here, take some goblin horns. Now shut up about being over encumbered. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. What are we fighting? What are we fighting? I have no clue. We're going up here. It looks like there's stuff up here. Oh, look what I found. In There's chest. something down there. Is it safe to descend? A jasper, which is actually a gemstone. It's also the name of my cat in real life, but it's a, ge a gemstone. So I guess it had some value there. It's probably a rare item. Oh. Greenware. Hey, almost fell. Greenware ish. Is there a point to this? No. There's no point to this. I came here for no reason. There's no chest or nothing. Look. What the fuck is this here for, then? Oh, we can keep going up. Oh my god, we're climbing this giant mountain. What's up here? I'm getting a little nervous. Look at this. There's a road up here. Wait a minute. Did we just intersect with the road we had already passed? We did, didn't we? This is a shortcut. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. It's just a shortcut. So, let's just follow the road now. At least this bridge seems a study. Yes, of course. I see it now. So, we are just finding all kinds of stuff along the way. We're finding chests. We're finding optional enemies. We're finding these far stones. We're finding uh, the uh, camps. And then we had a random quest, and we we saved some people that were getting jumped, right? So tons of stuff going on. I guess we can rest at this camp again. Yeah, we won't, because we just saved. We're not going to rest at the camp again. We'll just continue down the road. It looks like more enemies are back. Look. Yeah, look. What enemies are those? Are those more goblins? I think so. I think it's another goblin pack. Freshly rested as we are. This battle ought to be Oh, you fucker. I draw wow. a roaring flame. Your flame at any cost. 
Executed. Stay with me. He's already dead. He's already dead. Nice healing aura. And we burn them all. Okay, we had already looted this area. Alright, keep going. Follow the road. Oh shit. Or gobbies. I did the I did the wrong move. I wanna shield bash, I did the wrong move. Their death, their death animation, it takes so long. Christ. Alright. Keep going. Filling out the map is always a good thing. I mean, yeah, but we also want to make progress. I don't want to be endlessly, you know, stuck out here wandering. Let's keep moving. A nice deer. You probably hunt it for meat, I bet, right? You cook it at a campfire. Anything down there? No, it doesn't look like it. Why did the deer try to attack me? I wasn't doing anything. Come on, man. Another statue. May have to yield us sort of use. I can foresee no reason not to go see it up close. What statue are she talking about? Sometimes they mention stuff, and I have no idea what they're referencing. There's a side path. Where would this go? This would go off this way. I guess we could check it out. Is a remarkable oh, thank God. We need way more of these beetles, man. I want to keep increasing my, my carry weight. We got to get find like a trove of those. It would be cool if we walk into like a, a forest area and there's like 20 of those on the a trees. Fitting reward for a rigorous search. Oh, what the hell? Oh, no. What is it? I can't see. Is it another Cyclops? It is another Cyclops. Oh, boy. Great damage right now. Look at those chunks. He's stunned. We're stunning the shit out of him. And now lightning in his head. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, he grabbed me, he grabbed me. Shit, he tossed me off. Oh, I gotta save Scarlet. Am I on him? I don't need to be on. I want to get off. Save Scarlet. What are you doing? Why did you bring the body over here? That was incredibly stupid. Okay, run, 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 run. Whoa. That was my chance while he's distracted. I can't see. I can't see where I am. I'm not close enough to the front of the head. That's where I want to be, I think. Toss me off again. Shit. I don't have any more stamina items. Damn, that sucks. I'm down to one health bar now. I'm do a big slam, I think. Must not give them a chance to recover. What the Scarlet? Why did you stand in front of him when he did that? He literally didn't move. Okay. Now heal. You're the mage. Heal. Again? Wow, Scarlet sucks. We're five hundred times here.
I go. Yes, almost dead. Got it. We did it. He was stunned. I still sent him right in the face. Killed him. Beautiful. Age Scrag of Beast. Misshapen Eye. Scrag of Beast. Rugged Bone. And we both leveled up. Sweet. Sweet. Well, good work. Man, I had to kill Scarlet like 4,000 times there. Hui. All right. A fine place to harvest some ingredients. No harm in picking a few. Spaganito says I usually pick up the body before reviving. Good point. You can pick up the body, move it, and revive in a different spot. Wow. I forgot that about be? that. Thank you for that tip. We ought to take a closer look. We've got goblins. We have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness. Goblins. Where do you see goblins? I grant you fire's blade. Oh. Use it well. There's one goblin. What was it doing out here? It looks like they're saying there's something up there, but I don't know how to get up there. Your way up. Oh shit, I fell. Oh god. Oh, huh? Oh shit, here we go. A human! These guys are only about 80 experience each. The friggin' Cyclops was crazy. The Cyclops you was like, uh, 2,000 experience for killing it. And by the way, we found a camp, which is excellent, because Scarlet has, like, no health. After being down so many times. A human! Nice! 1,900 gold. Alright, let's rest. Let's get Scarlet's health back. Then we'll see if we can find a way to climb this thing. The human! <laughs> Reminds me of Quark in, uh... In Deep Space Nine. Humans! Okay. Well... We did a fair bit of shopping the other day, didn't we? Though I do wonder... Not for you, because we can't shop for the pawns. We can only shop for your main pawn and yourself. It would be nice if you could, but you can't. I wonder if you can damage the arm to make it drop the club and cling to it so it can't swing. Yes, you can. You can you can damage the arm and make it drop a weapon. That happens in the original game as well. Yep. Yes, you can. All those are very viable options in combat in this game. I'm not sure. I don't see how to get up here. They're basically saying there's an interest point on top of here. But I don't see a way to climb it. Well, again, maybe if we had the ability to fly or whatever. But I don't I'm not seeing it, so we're probably just gonna leave it behind and keep going down the road. So far we got a lot of money, cool right? How much money? We have seven thousand five hundred gold. We're at level eleven head. now, so actually we, we probably should soon get new pawns. Incident. Probably when we get to the Empire or the the uh like the support. Empire, the uh, capital. We should probably summon new pawns because our pawns now are kinda low level. Die down. Riverside ruins. Let my magic imbue your weapon with the fury of the elements. No, I refuse. Whoa, shit! Who the fuck is this? You bash that motherfucker! <laughs> Take this, bitch! My curative magics are at your disposal. Wait a minute. Peesh. They came running out of there. Here's another one. I'm gonna win. Oh. Damn, he's fast. <laughs> it's just clobber his body. He was flying. There's another one. Oh, how many are in here? Damn, blood squirting everywhere. Very brutal game. More? What the hell? Oh, they fell. They were up, up top and they fell off. 
Sheesh. I mean, that werewolf could have been a family living there. We just murdered them all. Because it doesn't matter in this universe. It's survival of the fittest, right? Get the fuck out of there. Out of the way, I want your salubrious drought. Or a, a draft. You say draft, right? Salubrious draft. Here we go. Another chest. Fancier one. Bird Greaves. That might be a new item I actually want to wear. Let's find out. Oh, no. What class is this for? Oh, it could go to rogues. Okay. Let's give it to Elric. Oh, yeah. It's better. A little bit sla less slash resistance, but it's better magic defense. It gives resistance to fire. Yeah, it's good. And then we could, uh... We'll get rid of the miner's hose and we'll sell that later. Yeah. <laughs> Try talking to them next time. If you didn't notice, he ran out and attacked me. I didn't have a chance to do shit. He got right in my face and started attacking me, so... I don't think there's much I could have done about that. Go. Oh, come on. Up a little bit. <clears throat> okay. And here was a ladder... Is that a way down right there? It is a way down. Do you see this? This. What is this? Where does this go? Now, what do we have here? Uh, what do we have here? There's nothing down here. What's the point of this? Is there seriously nothing down here? It's just a, a pointless basement? No, wait! There's a hidden door! With a chest behind it! Oh, cool! Alright, what's in the chest? An astounding discovery. 3,600 gold! Impressive. That's not bad at all. Alright. Very nice. Now I hear an enemy up top. Did you hear it? Sound like a goblin. Profitable endeavor. Yeah, that wasn't bad at all. I will say we got some good money out of that one. I think we're crossing this bridge, or... What the fuck did I just do? What is it doing this for? This is stupid. I want to see where I am. How do I zoom in? Can I not zoom in? Right thumbstick. There we go. So I am supposed to cross this bridge, and it looks like... That's where we're going to continue on. There might be something right there. Okay. All right, we made some good money in there. Thousands. Any other enemies out here, or is this all clear? This looks pretty clear. Except for that harpy. Need some help? Stupid harpy. It's a glad thing we rested. Ah, I fucking missed. Who was it that we helped? This guy. Who is that? What the hell is that noise? Oh, Christ, what's that noise? Oh, what is that? It's a new enemy. No, it's got two health bars. Oh, this is bad. I don't know if we can kill this thing. I'll try. This thing might be too tough. Look bitey face, we have to kill bitey face. I got you, boring flesh. No, there's goblins here. Are you fucking serious? Oh, this is bullshit. Where the fuck these goblins were not here, dude? I'm fucked. I'm gonna definitely have to die here. Wow, this sucks.
Okay, I got Bitey Face alive. Holy shit. Oh no, the health bars is down. Well, I can't climb this guy yet. Whoa! Shit! Help me up, I'm stunned. No stamina. Fuck. Why do you face is in trouble? It's putting its ass up, but it's not doing much damage, see? You really gotta get on its weak points. Okay, I gotta get Bitey Face out of there. Oh no, he came in and attacked me when I picked up Bitey Face. I'm unconscious. No. I can't get. Oh, he stepped on me. Dude, I can't move and no one's helping me. Look. I might as well use it. Okay. This guy's an asshole. Oh, he crushed me! I was on his back and he crushed me. There we go. Now we're doing damage. I wish I had stamina items. I don't. Well, I'm about to lose my grit. What is this? Bitey Face is in the water? Oh, I can't save Bitey Face. Bitey Face is dead. I don't know how they ended up in the fucking water. That doesn't even make sense. What the fuck? I tried to jump and grab it. He grabbed his hand. Here, I grabbed his ass. For some reason I'm doing no damage. I can't hit him. What's going on? How did I end up on his arm? I was on his back and now I'm on his arm. Oh my god, come back here. We would do well to seek the high ground when fighting on an angel. Ah, in the fucking face. Yes, keep doing it. Uh, now we're doing it. Uh, look at that damage. Elwick is distracting it while I stab the fuck out of its head. It's almost dead now. Come on, keep stabbing. Come on. He's fucking stabbing and impaling that head. Oh, he tossed me off. He's stunned. He's dead. We did it. We killed the goddamn thing. That was a rare monster. Okay. Ogre. That's an ogre. Monster hide, ogre spur. But Bitey Face is dead. Yeah, Bitey Face died during the fight. Got tossed into the water. Just yonder looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Shall we see if there's ought to be found while we're here? Oh, but guess what? We can summon a new pawn right now. By the way, I gotta split the part. I didn't realize how late I went here. Alright, we're level 12. We can summon a level 12 ranger now. We absolutely should do that. Bitey face died, but it's all good. Oh, I can't search manually? Oh, I guess not. Alright, we need a ranger. I'm level... I'm level 12, so this ranger 
I have 344 rift coins. I could get this one, Garnet. He's huge. Giant woman. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, I think we're gonna get that one. We get Vista is free though. Let's get Vista. I've a knack for gathering items and am ever okay. on the hunt for new finds. I'll gladly try out any useful mechanisms I She's expect. free. Because she's level 11. Delighted to meet okay. you. Especially if we share a sweet tooth. What? Okay. And then Scarlet is level... What level is she? 9? So we're 12. We should try to get a higher level mage. 16 is pretty darn high. Uh, another one? Just want to compare... The level 11 mage. Alright, let's get the level 11. I know precisely when a curative is needed, Master. You'll never fall in battle. Get rid of uh, Scarlet, who's only level 9. Miss Scarlet. Yeah. So as... Alright. Yeah, it wouldn't let me manually search, and I don't know why. Give a gift. I'll give a gift of... A rotten fish. It's rotten fish. <laughs> At least I go knowing I fought to the best of my ability. Very good. Let us work together to honor the... All right. Specializations are skills that can only be acquired by pawns. They're not strictly beneficial. They allow the pawn to act independently and can result in unexpected consequence. However, with a little patience, planning, and due care, specializations can prove useful. If you'd like your pawn to learn a specialization, you would do well to befriend people with various traits and tendencies in the world around you. Sooner or later, friendships are bound to create opportunities. A pawn can only acquire specializ one specialization at a time, and learning a new customization replaces the old one. Okay. All right, we're done for now. We got new pawns, and then we're going to save up. Split the part here. All right, we got two new pawns now that are going to be much tougher. Let me make sure I'm not over-encumbered. I'm not. Good. Okay. Um, I think this is a good place to split. Let's actually save. After doing that that fun ogre fight, right? That was fun. And uh, I'll be right back with more. I hope you guys are still enjoying Dragon's Dogma 2. If you are and you're watching on demand, if you could like this video and leave some comments on it, let me know what you think. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you soon.